Hello and welcome to the lecture on linking CSS. If you want to link multiple CSS together, not in an HTML, but from one CSS, you want to link another CSS. That's what we're going to learn in this lecture. Okay. So let's create a folder. Okay. We'll use these files. Okay. And we'll call it as linking. Okay. And we will call this as two and this will call this as one and what we want to do is our actual style should be in style2.css the style1 should include style2 and we'll include style1 in the linking.html all right so let's do that example so let's import the style1 okay and inside style1 i want to import style2 means your styling is in style2 but linking.html is calling style1 okay so there's an hop between your actual style sheet so style1 i want to import the style2 okay so how you can do it there's a statement called import you can say style1 style2.css okay and you end with a semicolon so what happens is when linking.html imports style1.css that is this file this file will import style2.css so this file is already available in the html page okay so let's look at the output now okay so it's red in color means the styles has been applied and we are looking at the linking.html page all right so if you see style1.css there's nothing in the style1.css it is importing style2.css the style 2.css as actually having your CSS. Okay. So this is how you basically do linking of CSS from one CSS file to another CSS file. You can not only import CSS, you can also import fonts and you can import some other resources that you want to import inside the CSS. So once we go to that section, we'll also try to experiment with the imports. All right. The one good method of having this is you want, you can split your CSS into multiple files right you want to have a css for header you want to have a css for you know the footer you want to have a css for you know only the navigation menu you can actually do that and then you can have one css that is style.css which import all those css all those snippets of the css so this way you get to work with a specific small css and then you have all those css embedded into one css file which is nothing but the style.css which will import in the html file okay so what I mean by that is in conceptually, you might have something like this. You will have header.css, then you will have navigation.css, then you will have content.css and then you will have your footer.css. All right. And when you go to linking.html, you're only importing one CSS file. Okay. And you don't worry about all those imports that you actually have. You have like four CSS, but you're not importing four CSS into the main HTML page. What you typically do is you write all those CSS. You create one CSS, which imports all the other CSS and you use that one CSS into your linking of your HTML page. All right. So this is the concept of linking. It's very important and we typically use this because there will be different developers working on different sections of the CSS. So one is working on header, one is working on navigation. So this way, once they're done, they just upload their header and we don't have to worry about changing our HTML page. All right. It's all link up with this one style dot CSS. All right. So this is an example of how and where you can start linking of the CSS resources. Okay, so that's all on this lecture on linking CSS and I'll see you in the next one.